uh, yeah, maybe just a, a bit of a background on the product. You've, you know, this is the third year that it's been as part of the uh, AgriTrend Summer Tour in different plots. But uh, so the technology is not you new. It's been around for about 10 years in research. Uh, the idea of concern about seed safety is not new. We've been concerned for years and years. Uh, but what's happening in agriculture is, you know what, our farmers are getting bigger and they're probably trying to do more work with less help. So the concern about being efficient and good use of your time is still causing concern when it comes to seed safety. How do we get more done in less passes across the field? So if we look at a product like ESN, obviously it wasn't designed initially with the idea of seed safety. But as the technology has evolved, and especially at the grower level, it is becoming more and more adapted because of the usage of giving you the opportunity to put more nitrogen down with the seed and getting more done in one pass. So if we look at the plots, uh, 20, 40, 60, and 80 pounds of actual nitrogen seed placed with 12.5% seed bed utilization. I mean, at the 80 pound rate, that's extremely aggressive. Uh, but yet, because of the way the product's designed, with the polymer, uh, your release of nitrogen from that granule is, is based on temperature, so it's moderated throughout the season. What happens is you put it in the soil, water will diffuse through the plastic. Once it's fully liquefied inside, then based on temperature in your soil, that plastic will expand and start to sweat out liquefied urea. So at any given day, we're only maybe getting two to three pounds of nitrogen exposed per acre in that seed row so that gives us the ability to have that high degree of, of seed safety. 